How's it going guys? I'm your host Dev04066 and welcome back to a very special AQ video. So I've actually just bought the 7500 Zek token package along with the blood contract miss item and for today's video we will be opening up some golden gift boxes as I attempt to hunt for the elusive ultra rare gift box to finally get my hands on that darkness weapon which I've wanted for so long. But first of all I will be using the blood contract and swapping it out with my Swordmaster Emblem. Now, to be fair, the blood contract actually does not provide any real boost to your damage or whatnot. It just speeds up the overall battle because um, you're not the only one dealing higher damage. The monster is also dealing higher damage. So it sort of evens out everything and I'll actually be swapping it out with my Swordmaster Emblem simply because I can now use this with all weapons instead of just swords. Now, without further ado, let us get get into the main meat of today's video which is the ultra rare golden gift box opening so let us buy 10 so we have four tries uh which is 40 gift boxes hopefully we don't have to open too much before we get what we want so let's see common nope let's just skip that and in the event that i do not get it hopefully i do get enough uh, rares and commons to convert them into one ultra rare at the end of the day i do have quite a few saved up can't really remember how much I have exactly, but I can just go into my account page and convert them into ultra rares if need be. So, 3 boxes so far and they've all been commons. Uh, really unlucky. Come on, ultra rare. Nope. Common again. Now, uh, the boxes, uh, whether they are rare, ultra rare or common, have already been determined the moment you press the buy button. They are not determined when you open them, so they are determined already. So hopefully we get something good out of this stash of 10. Please don't just give me all commons. Oh, we got a rare, but that's not what we want. Come on, ultra rare. I just need one. I really just want the weapon. Um, Nope, common again. Another common shop. Wow, really unlucky. Ultra Rares, finally! Wow! In our first stash of 10! Damn! Okay, that went a lot better than I expected. Wow, I was getting uh, kind of disheartened when like the first 10 uh, uh, were almost all common. So, yeah, finally! Okay, Agony's Embrace. And we are not going to sell any items simply because we have enough Zek tokens. So what I'm going to do is buy more extra slots for my weapons. I do need to buy quite a few more extra slots actually. Um... Can't remember how many slots you can buy up to. I think it's 50. Is it 50 or is it 100? I can't remember. Let's just continue buying until we have enough. 65 or 65. Let's buy another slot. Because we have Zek tokens to burn through. Hell yeah. No. Uh, almost forgot to buy the item there. Right. So finally, we are going to be buying Agony's Embrace. Yeah. The best darkness weapon in the game, and now I can swap it out with Calibor. Um, Calibor is long overdue. I mean, it still is a very, sh very strong darkness weapon. Don't get me wrong, but um, I've been using it for a long time, and Agony's Embrace definitely outdoes it in terms of damage. So you want to get Agony's Embrace if you can. So let's save sort order, and yeah, we finally got it. Right, let's see. Um. So looks like we have everything else. Alright, let's let's just take a look at the shop to see if there's anything else we want. Uh maybe I can just open the remaining ten. The remainder of my gift boxes. Ragnarok, nope, not gonna get that. Man or War X, nope, Luminous Swift. Um this might actually be good to get uh Luminous Swift. I think the hour looks amazing as well, boosting your wind spells. That's definitely nice to get, but I think I'll pass it up. Because I think Tamer is slightly better. I got the Cutlasses already. Dragon Claw, nope, don't want that. Frost Destroyer. Um, this will be a good ice weapon as well, a good replacement for uh Horror Show. But I want to keep Horror Show simply because um Horror Show is uh melee damage and also because you can change it to void, which is not something that every weapon has. This is unfortunately magic, so I will be passing it up. Titan Slayer, nope. Uh Golden Paragon Staff. 
Nope, not gonna get that. The bow, nope. Uh, hammer, basically the same thing. Giant Butcherer already have that. Your chance might. Uh, void. Oh, this is very similar to Horror Show, except it's once again it's magic and it's darkness instead. Trail Scorn already got that. Gilded Dread Scythe. The only thing that I really, really want from the Golden Gift Boxes or I want for something to return is actually the um, Dragon Fire Sword. Or that's what, or if, if I remember that name correctly. Yeah, the Dragon Fire Sword. That was the best fire weapon in the game, and I believe it still is. It slightly outdoes Trail Scorn, at least in my opinion, when it's activated. So I do still want the Dragon's Fire, uh, Dragon Fire Sword. It hasn't come back for long. In fact, it hasn't come back at all. Unfortunately, it was only released one time in an ultra rare gift box. I'm still hoping for its return. Hopefully, they can, you know, let it come back in another form or something like that. I really want it, and I think its effect is amazing. Okay, so let us look at the um armors. Nothing really much that I want for armors. <coughs> Paragon, nope. Uh, there are some armors that have amazing artwork here, but they don't really. They they are not that good in terms of skill and other stuff. So, I'm the items I'm getting is for. Uh, how do I call it? It's more for a realistic kind of thing rather than aesthetic. So, uh, I get stuff that actually helps me in battles that I think are actually statistical statistically good or give me an advantage i don't get stuff uh, purely for the artwork alone Un unless they are gold only so i i may make an exception nope uh not gonna get that uh spells i think the blood hawk is a uh, really strong pet as well i will get it if i get a spare gift uh ultra rare but i don't think i'll get it if i don't have it uh the core blood hawk is definitely a must have for these masters in my opinion it's one of the best guests in the game Siphon already have that Tunda and Call of the Angel of Darkness and Tunamis. Not sure which one I have. I think I have Tunamis. There yeah, are Tunamis. Oh wait, no, I'm looking at the wrong one. Yeah, I have Tunamis and I have. Uh, what do I have? Do I have the Call of the Angel of Darkness? Nope, I don't have that, but I would like to have that as well if I actually get more stuff or uh, I actually get more Ultra Rares. Okay, so Luna, I actually have that from a long time ago. This is not that good. Lala already have that. Silas, not that good. Sutterby, not really that good. Tiny Void Pony. This is actually a good pet. Um, for those of you who uh wants a pet that deals void damage, this is really good and it can uh occasionally deal extra critical damage or something like that if I remember correctly. Tree troll, not really that good. Fu dog, no, don't want that. As well as reaper. This is actually decent. I think this is a pretty good pet as well as well as <coughs> chicken cow clone. I think I have that, but that's pretty useless. Zorbo, no, Death Arrow's Cat. Uh, Death Arrow's Cat is a excellent darkness pet as well for those who want who are considering getting it. Randor, yep, Randor is pretty good as well. So yeah, miscellaneous. Don't want uh Radiant Prism and Radiant Prism is pretty useless. Uh, Olix Oblivion we already have that obviously. So yeah, really nice. Let us just open up the last box and see what we get. If we get another Ultra Rare, I will buy another item. I, I don't think so. Yep, common. So, yeah, really nice. We got it in our first 10 and got really lucky and now we still have 6,300 tokens to spare. And finally got the darkness weapon that I wanted. I hope you guys enjoyed this short video and this opening of the golden gift box. If you have, be sure to give it a thumbs up and of course be sure to subscribe to my channel for more of such future content. Till the next time, this has been Dev0466. Peace out.